uh, good morning Vietnam yeah people are f fake full of shit okay uh, after uh, uh, those two video I made about NASA uh, normally it's game over normally it's game over when you see uh, a tank made of stainless steel okay uh, collapsing under atmospheric pressure not even atmospheric pressure he said it in the video it was two-thirds of the atmospheric pressure it collapses steel stainless steel 12 gold or something it's thick shit okay it collapsed you can see it in the video it's a company this is one of the risks they have to manage atmospheric pressure against negative pressure okay inside of the tank okay and then if you still believe that those morons on the moon are jumping around in pressurized fabric suits you are fake you are a moron you are an NPC you are a sims whatever okay if, if you don't get it by now you are, you are doing it by purpose it's, it's your game it's an energetic game you want attention uh, you are in the game of energy okay so those might be just here for the game of energy there is no it's not a real opinion it's about what energy they get by having that opinion okay okay so let's ex extend expand this uh, concept of those energetic uh, vampires just having an opinion for the sake of sucking energy okay let's extend it to the people waiting for Jesus okay you know the people waiting for Jesus that they want you also to wait for Jesus okay they, they come to me they tell me Jesus is gonna save you you know they, they get to you they, mostly south of Europe here they are a little bit they keep distance you know in the park they have their little billboard and they stay away you know but you, when I go south they can come you know close like they get familiar okay so next time somebody or someone of them will come to me tell me Jesus will come to save me I tell him I already seen him in the city he's there I saw him in the shopping center call their bluff okay call their bluff and see what happened please people try this and tell me what happens when you call their bluff the people waiting for Jesus tell them I saw him he was in the city center I saw him he's already there okay and see if what see his reaction if he's genuine or you know if he will be excited and tell me what happened yeah fucking robot okay robot of the matrix I'm, I'm not falling for your tricks anymore I will call your bluff okay I will call your Jesus bluff uh, escaping the matrix also that is new religion okay okay they now they are playing this new game okay they want attention they want energy okay so you escape the mind when you die you go to the light not to the light or to do something you know go to the ladies toilet I don't know the trick so you escape the matrix but he, they are here with you they don't escape they are, they are just here in front of you telling you to escape the matrix so what, what what does it mean he's here for the game for the game of of talking to you of interacting with your energy call their bluff call their bluff tell them I have a cousin I have somebody I know he escaped the matrix okay okay he went to the light not to the light he did the right choice he was a smart guy and he communicates with me okay telepathically he communicates he told me it sucks the other side okay call their bluff call their bluff okay and see see where it goes okay see if, if, if really they are for real or they are here just to for the game with you the game of energy guys I'm, I'm starting to understand how they operate they are they are everywhere guys they are everywhere even against the government they will go outside in the street blah blah and shout you know and then when the wind turn a little bit they can be comrades they become confined they stay at home they don't move you know so all this is circus okay you can blah blah and go outside and and risk getting a, get some more on hit you with the stick all this is okay and then with the little uh, fear fear uh, operation you you become uh, confined okay like a rat I mean, you are a rat you are just an NPC of the matrix you are nothing okay be careful guys of those guys because if you are in a group them they will they will all they will all retract and turn backward because they are sims NPCs there is not a insect toys and you you will find find yourself in the front line okay this is why you have to cut with these groups guys you have to cut with these groups it's very important
okay because you you're going to be sacrificed in any stuff if you are still naive okay but if you are there just, uh, there just to play you know and you know discover is study them study them like i told you i will call call their bluff and see what happened okay okay but, but be careful don't uh, don't be naive okay now we understand how they operate they are here for the game of the energy uh, they will do anything they will morph you know they morph they adapt to the situation just to get their position their energy there to survive just like an insect guys they come from and they're insectoid there is not the higher purpose is just in our head and they can fake they can mimic you know they can mimic and you you think they are for real they can they can seem very smart uh, i used to talk with people i thought they are smart genuinely you know when i was naive and then when there is not the source of energy they become dumb Okay, so it was all fake. They, they survived on your own, you know, consciousness, uh, beholding them, uh, watching them, so they can, you can even generate some, some smartness that you can even believe it yourself. It's like you create them, you know, by, by looking at them, by being with them, you create them. Okay, those NPCs, it's crazy. Now, now I'm thinking about it. I said something very, very deep, guys, now, right now, right now. Okay, I will listen to it again because it's beautiful. Okay. So, so the, now we understand. We, we understand it's a bullshit. People are fake. Okay, people are fake. Uh, yeah, I was thinking about this uh, Elon Musk guy. Uh, the, the, the space shit. Okay, the space shit is bullshit. But the, the, maybe the big electron, by sending this uh, Elon Musk, manifesting it, this Elon Musk doubles on. He doubles on the, the lies. Okay. Like SpaceX, now rockets come backward. Okay, he, he put even something more crazy, more unbelievable technologically, uh, but bullshit. Okay, rockets coming ba backward with the with the power of a you know of, of a rocket, you know, and managing all the impossible. Okay, back in the days, it was a space shuttle. Okay, it enters and it has to have a specific uh, uh, stuff, thermal protection, and there it enters a certain angle with the atmosphere. And it entered just for, you know, like a planning on the air, you know, it didn't have a propulsion to come back. So it needs to, it was complicated story. Okay, when, when people were a little bit smarter, okay. Now the guys, okay, rockets come backwards. It's like, it's like, it's like the big electron telling you, I can go far and they are dumb. It's maybe a message for us to understand that there is no limit to stupidity. Okay. Space stuff coming backward. Okay. No limits. Okay, me explaining pressure and stuff and air quality and biological problems of in, uh, in astronauts uh, staying in space, how they eat. No, space rocket came backward. Okay, so, so it, goes, it goes further the other direction. Okay, Elon Musk, it might be an operation from the divine guys to tell us there is no limit of, of stupidity of those NPCs. Seems they just follow the program. Okay, maybe it's a message for us. I mean, the guy says it says it it looks so fake because it is real or something like that you remember he said it himself okay so he's doubling on like oh, more okay telling you there is no limit okay then he tells you artificial intelligence is dangerous stuff stuff and i'm gonna put chips in the brain of the people okay doubling on the, the, the problem okay big electron maybe telling yes there is nobody you are expecting people to see, they, they, they don't exist. Maybe it's a fucking message for us, okay, to wake up that we are dealing with, uh, with, with NPCs, okay, with morons, okay, and no limits, okay, okay. Uh, the satellite, I said, I said satellite is bullshit, okay, I know satellites, I worked in the antenna field and everything, okay, now he's doubling on satellite. Satellite, you needed a satellite antenna to... to to, to receive a satellite, okay? Now his internet system doesn't need an, uh, an antenna of satellites. It's a small shit. Small shit connecting to the cell tower directly, like your smartphone uh, on the 1235, you know? And he connects with internet and he just tells you it's satellite. That's it, that's it. That's, it. that's the trick now. Back in the day, it was a fucking big trick. You needed a big antenna that was really beaming some um, some signal okay to south africa something to get to get your internet per satellite back in the day it was for companies working in uh, you know in uh, outside in a you know a petroleum industry and everything they needed internet connection everywhere so it was internet via satellite between bucket but it was really big antennas beaming a signal 
uh, into a geostationary uh, orbiter, you know, equatorial orbiter where uh, supposedly all the satellites are. And it was bouncing back to somewhere in South Africa where there is internet, you know, uh, broadcasted. They receive it by by fiber optic or stuff and they, they beam it. Uh, in the sky by big antennas, land antennas, and they will tell you it's satellites. It was a nice trick, complicated, and you had, uh, you know, what we call a ping. Ping is you test at the time between uh, you sending an internet, uh, you know, request and uh, the time the uh, the reply come, and you can see the difference when you are using satellite. There was a gap because there was this distance uh, of the signal getting there. Okay, now the guy doesn't uh, doesn't care about this. He, t he sell you a, a cell a cell phone antenna, cell towers connecting to the new fast network. Okay, and it uh, it tells you a satellite, and it works. Morons, they work. The ping on on, on his uh, styling system are very little. It's like internet with fiber optic or something because it's very local. There is nothing going up in the space and back. You know, uh, nothing. It's, it's direct with the cell tower. So he has pings. Like a, like a, like a smartphone, a very capable smartphone in the last generation of a, of a frequency one two three five, uh, and, and that's it. And they sell it to you as a, a satellite, and it works. What is this? It's telling you we are morons. We the NPCs, we the Sims here, we are morons. Okay, so guys, it's uh, the time the time for us to get the less the lesson with the, with whom we have affair. Okay, with. The, we do what people we are dealing with. Uh, the good, the good things. Th there is a good thing. The more we wake up, the more uh, those, uh, you know, those uh, NPCs, especially the the, the 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 demonic one, the pervert, they will eat eat each other. Okay, they, they recognize their smell. Okay, when there is no no food, they will they will get to to attack you. They will, if you are between them, they will join their force to to destroy you but when you retract we understand what they do they eat each other this is the good point guys this is my it might be the uh, the good uh, the good point to observe is when they start to eat each other as as uh, we we understand what they are and we uh, stop feeding stop feeding energy and we see them eating each other there is no no principle with them they are insectoids uh, let's watch them eat each other and enjoy the show yeah, uh, on the photo is uh, is me actually uh, with the flat earthers. Just take me with you. I want to be in your community. Okay, it's a, it's a calling. I need to be. Yeah, I have enough. I want to be with you and talk about the shape of the earth for six hours straight. Okay, nothing else. I want to forget. You know, it's like this guy in Fight Club when he cries on on the big fat guy on Bob. You know, I want, I have enough. I want to relax, just talk about the shape of the earth for six hours straight and no other subject, okay? Yeah, take me with you, flat earthers, please. See you in the next video.